2022 so far has been different things to different people, you know, yeah. and there've been many moments, you know, that we would love to remember, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. you know, and proud moments in different industries from sports to music, music to movies. But, you know, we've talked a lot about the music industry and how well it's doing, but that's not the only industry that's, you know, really blazing the trail yeah. and making us proud as Nigerians. Mm -hmm. We have the movie industry and I'd like us to highlight some of the most interesting things that happened in the movie industry, especially, you know, talking about the movies that were released, you know, we've seen some of the beautiful works you know writers writing great stories producers producing great movies yeah. actors taking roles and it has just been beautiful everyone deserves luxury but luxury means different things to everyone luxury can mean appreciating the scenery of nature and stepping out to bask in the warmth of sunlight. Sometimes, luxury is savoring the satisfying and huggy taste of Amstel Malta Ultra. Other times, luxury is having enough selfie moments with your bestie. But in the end, real luxury is choosing your way to live. Amstel Malta Ultra. Choose your way to live. Views unbothered. This year has been a very fascinating year and interesting year for Nollywood. Um, I mean, you, you you now watch movies that is not really star-studded, but you are having fun and mm -hmm. you're interested in knowing how it ends. Uh, this year was actually uh, also a breakout year for a lot of Nollywood producers. I mean, Netflix has been on the scene for like a couple of years now, yeah, but just this year, Amazon Prime also mm -hmm. hopped on Nollywood Productions. Um, we have indigenous languages um, that are also, you know, being shown on Amazon Prime, uh, King of Thieves, it's a Yoruba film. Hmm. And it's on Amazon Prime. In fact, it was one of the first Nollywood films to feature on Amazon Prime. And that's hmm. very interesting. That's a big deal. Yeah. Yeah. And it's not, it's not um, uh, secluded to just the English speaking uh, movies. So that's one big interesting thing. Yes. I would yeah. also yeah. like to, like to say that before okay. now, we used to be worried that, oh, can this movie make the cinemas or this, this movie is not suitable for the cinemas and mm -hmm. all that. But now I don't think we're worried because every yeah. hit has been like, you know, cinema worthy. Yeah. 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 I'll say also one of the big moments was, you know, had Marvel Studios coming to Nigeria, we were Kanda forever. So we're not only seeing really great Hollywood stories, we're seeing a lot of, you know, we're even seeing Hollywood produce African stories. Yeah. Yeah, and you see, come to Nigeria, come to, to, Nigeria to, to have premiere the premiere of their movie. Yeah. So I think we're, we're, we're getting there. We're getting there. But Nollywood. what movies did it for you this year, Gabby? So for me, one of the best movies that I watched this year, um, it is a 2021 movie, actually. Mm. Um, it was a movie that was released in 2021, you know, but became very popular in 2022. And that for me was Breaded Life. Last night was mad late, bro. Hey, oh, my lit. <laughs> <laughs> And Taji, Ma, have you seen my son? I hate her. Ah, oh yeah, I watched that yeah. movie. A lot, of people, a lot of people who I know, you know, say I, I don't really like the story. So I just want to ask, do you feel was, like was, actors in a particular movie actually influence how people like it? Because yes. I mean, we had the life yes. of it depends. Yeah. It depends. That is obvious. Yes, actually. but it, it, I feel like it, a lot of times it depends on their performance. Because yeah, like, for example, actors, of course, we expect that they perform well. Definitely, but Bimbo Ademoye is someone everybody loves. Mm -hmm. Everybody loves Bimbo Ademoye's acting. Everybody loves Timini love as well. Exactly, Timini mm -hmm. himself. Tinamba. There are a lot of people. Tinamba. We had MC was also there surprisingly <laughs> yes we remember that and then we also had MC Lively in the movie as yeah, well we had, um, yeah. Nina we had Bisola Bolanle was in the movie uh -huh. as well yeah, yeah. Bisola so, yeah, yeah. star started yeah very star started I think the best part of it for me was you know watching Timini's acting mommy 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 please who is this this is my sister this this is this is this is supposed to be me now I definitely don't know you ah I'm glad you don't be lying now I don't know this young man I think I is always a fantastic Timini is a great actor, actor mm -hmm. but no. in that particular I remember movie, the arguments we had. I was Timini like, is a fantastic wow. actor. <laughs> wow. Boy, boy is good. Boy is good. So mm -hmm. it's what the hype, right? No, yeah, definitely. Yeah, what? What's what, 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 I like it when you hear it. every single mm. hype. Man power. <laughs> so for right? me, I think I would say the first one would be Blood Sisters. I mean, that was a fantastic movie. Everyone deserves luxury. But luxury means different things to everyone.
Luxury can mean appreciating the scenery of nature and stepping out to bask in the warmth of sunlight. Sometimes, luxury is savoring the satisfying and huggy taste of Amstel Malta Ultra. Other times, luxury is having enough selfie moments with your bestie. But in the end, real luxury is choosing your way to live. Amstel Malta Ultra. Choose your way to live. Fuels unbuttered. First, I'd like to thank you for raising the most beautiful woman I have ever seen. I said that because, I mean, Mo Abudu, an executive producer, has always been producing movies. And most times, like, okay, it's just there and all that. Not but really. This one. But Blood Sisters and also Oloture. I don't know if I pronounced that right. Mm, that was also a fantastic movie. But Oloture was, was No, no, it was in 2019. I'm talking yeah. about, like, the okay. two movies that she had she produced. Done, yeah, okay. Blood, Blood Sisters was really fantastic. One of the ways that we started the year in Hollywood. You know, watching that particular mm. movie was a good way to actually start the year for mm, Nollywood yeah. because everybody didn't expect it. I mean, this this was one of its kind. When you say start Nollywood? Like, like we started, 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 started this year. Okay. Okay. At the start oh, okay, of the year. Okay. Yeah, this was mm -hmm. one of the movies that mm -hmm. everybody, you know, started with, you know. So I think Blood Sisters was really amazing. Yeah. We didn't we expect had... the storyline to go the way that it did. Mm -hmm. We were seen as a seamen. I like the action. Cool the action was yeah. intriguing. Yeah. There was a lot of suspense mm -hmm. in the yeah. movie. Definitely and suspense was the there. the costuming was actually Amazing. Very good. Amazing. Cinematography was out on. Honestly, yeah. I mean, like the old ceremony, the attire that they put on. The casting was fantastic as well. Yeah, yeah. Um, but for me, I will say uh, two movies, Anikulakpo and um, Brotherhood. Anikulako was trending. Anikulako, I mean, I mean, you know, the, the thing about movies is that when everybody's talking about it and there's an hype on that movie, when mm. you're watching it, you're watching it like, okay, let's okay, go yeah. see yeah, what yeah, they're talking yeah. about. And I feel like it was worth the hype. I mean, Kunle Afalayan is not someone mm. that uh, I know would do anything that is mediocre. You get me? Mm. So yeah, we all know watching that, that movie, uh, was really really interesting the props the set design the choice of actors yeah. Bimbo Ademoye Kule Remy Kule Remy Shola I just, and Kule yeah. was also featured there yes yeah, for and, as well. I, mean, I mean and till now there are a lot of memes I, 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 I you have yeah. to mention that you yeah. also yeah. have to mention that Mr. Macaroni was in the movie as well yeah he had a good feature in that movie yeah true and, true. and the next movie would be Brotherhood <laughs> I like you. You did visualize this, my plan. I need to visualize your plan. Huh? That movie was very interesting yeah. for, uh, to me because, I mean, that's the first time I'm going to watch a proper action, action movie. movie that was acted in Nigeria with stunts. Mm. Like, all those times that the car tumbled, the bikes, you know, rolling, and they used mm. Todd Millan Bridge, bro. Uh -huh. Like, they used Todd Millan Bridge to do all those action. It was really interesting. Yeah, it and it's not, like, it's not like all those films that they will shoot and, you know, the bullets would have gone before the sound. <laughs> <laughs> all right, guys, let's go on the show break. When we get back, we have more to talk about. Don't move muscle. That's right. Everyone deserves luxury. But luxury means different things to everyone. Luxury can mean appreciating the scenery of nature and stepping out to bask in the warmth of sunlight. Sometimes, luxury is savoring the satisfying and huggy taste of Amstel Malta Ultra. Other times, luxury is having enough selfie moments with your bestie. But in the end, real luxury is choosing your way to live. Amstel Malta Ultra. Choose your way to live. Feels unbothered. So we just finished talking about some of the movies that really made hits in 2022. Let's talk about some celebrities that were all in our faces on social media, all right? So, Wala. I mean, like we there had the James there. Brown, we had the Bob Risky, we had Inkechi Blessed, we had Yol Edoche. Hey, I feel like that's the power of everything that I was, I was waiting president. for Yol Edoche. A lot of disappointment from Yol. I feel like Yol definitely topped the list yeah, of some of the yeah. most controversial <laughs> celebrities in this particular year. Sorry, I just you want know. to ask, mm. is, is he still running for presidency? Wow, wow. 
how we, know, how we know that? I don't know, honestly. But with what has happened, I feel like I don't know. It's, he's going to be really bold to just come out and say, mm. "I'm going to be a president." There's, there's, mm-hmm. There was a lot surrounding y'all this year. Mm-hmm. I mean, man was giving us From inspiration. Politics. He was giving. Us, he started with <laughs> a lot of inspirational quotes, wife. giving yeah. us inspirational quotes. The Baba went to shoot gun and you know, enter somewhere <laughs> else. And I mean, had like what's it called? A child out of wedlock and decided to like cover get it married. up, right. to get married to cover mm. it up. Huh. But for me, the most controversial person this year would be. Definitely. It, that guy has consistency when it comes to controversies. Yeah, actually. we From know that. January till December, Portable was always in the news every month. Portable was but there. Either for one thing or the other. someone, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. fighting with someone, beating someone Breaking from record bed. label. Yo, part of, <laughs> but I think I would say um, James Brown. James Brown. James Brown got back from the UK and we didn't hear the last of it. Duchess of what is it called? <laughs> <laughs> Ju- Duchess, Duchess of Africa. 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 I mean, at okay. first, it was Princess of Africa. Princess of Africa. Don't no, it's not cow. Africa. 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 That's what they yeah. say. Africa. Then when he got back from London, I mean, I, I just felt like, yo, you've gone to a civilized place. Like, I mean, so there's supposed to be some study. level of influence mm. on you. Like, it's supposed to rub off like, oh, yo, I just got back from London, in it. But yo, <laughs> this one was like, Duchess of Africa. And man changed from, okay, we know that he's been doing the old cross-dressing thing mm. for yeah, like for ever. A while. And out of the blues. Uh, James Brown granted an interview and said he has, he's not a man again. Yeah. And he, he was and dripping. You know, what do you think influenced that? Because nobody's talking about it. How did you just all of a sudden decide that, okay, I'm going back to be the guy? And he, he had, really he had a, a sex tape that leaked also. Okay. Yeah, yeah, that was that's another okay. one. Okay. That's another so you one. see why this was... guy, you see why this guy is actually very, <laughs> you think very that was it, troublesome. No, I, I feel like this guy just wants, he has, he just has a dynamic way of staying, staying relevant. Because when Queen, um, of blessed memory, Queen Elizabeth, yeah, uh, when she was, passed. did you see the way he was rolling on the floor? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Like, I was like, oh, my queen mother. Oh, I was like, yo. I dude. feel like that person would be big pops, papaya. Yes. Because we're having questions of how she makes her money. She's come out to say, oh, I'm one of the favorite she influencers. Has, she, has bought, um, uh, she, mean, has she has bought, she has bought her family members' cars. Yeah, she has bought, bought a bigger house. house. Yo, I don't <laughs> know. I don't know where they are seeing this money, please. But I mean, then again, it's been an interesting year and a lot of influencers have made a lot of money this yeah. year. That's because another thing. We, we, yeah. we must also uh, state that. Makers. that it was a year for ski makers, mm. honestly. Yeah. All right, guys, we have, still have more to talk about, but we have to draw the curtains here. All you have to do right now is to kindly, all right, subscribe to our YouTube channel and click the notification button so you can be aware when we drop a new video on YouTube. It is The Fuse on Instagram, Fuse Local. Hey, subscribe, follow, hit the notification button so join you can be alerted and join the conversation. Right. Most importantly, hey guys, you can link up with me, AB underscore AKYNZ on all social media platforms. You'll find me on Instagram at Gabby.Gabby. Do all to follow, guys. And I am underscore Madichu on all social media platforms. Until next time, guys, stay, stay fused. fused. It's crazy. Upfront and personal, world-class business, world-class consultants.